Hello friends, so welcome. In this video I'm going to install the Laravel Breeze and I'm going to create the admin user. Okay, so let's go to the Laravel. Dot com and uh, I want to say you because I had uh, many comments in the first video uh, if I'm going to add payments here or not. Uh, here, this project is going to be only for a reservation, so the people can go uh, see the menu, the category, and make a reservation and choose a table and how many people they are. But uh, for pool with ordering and uh, online payments, I'm going to create a paid course and I'm going to upload in the Udemy very soon. So here just is going to be a restaurant app for a reservation. So go and make a reservation to the website. Okay, now let's go to the starter kits in Laravel, installation, and we need to run this command composer require laravel slash breeze let's copy this go to the terminal and paste that in okay after that we need to run the php artisan breeze install let's copy paste that in and uh, we need to install the run the npm install and npm run dev. Okay, let's copy and add them here. Hit enter. After that, we need to run the PHP artisan migrate. But before that, let me go to the database migrations user stable and let me add here one more field so dollar sign table. And we need to add a boolean for is admin and by default is going to be false. Save this and close this one. Okay, now uh, before creating PHP migrate, let me create one uh, seeder for admin. So PHP artisan make seeder admin and if i go now to the seeders admin here i'm going to create a new user and make sure you import the user here and say user create and we need to create the admin user so i'm going to say name is going to be with capital admin uh, email is going to be admin gmail.com and what we can do others uh, we need to add the password the hash password and for that let's go to the factory user factory and here we have the password let's copy this or uh, let's copy all and paste them here so the email verified now and password this is the hash string for the uh, password and also the remember token semicolon down and save let's close this open the database seeder and after here, I'm going to say that I sign this call and we need to call the admin class. Okay, hit save, close this and in the terminal, let's run now PHP artisan migrate dash dash seed. Hit enter. Okay, we need, I forget to import the STR here. Illuminate support, STR, let's save and run again. 
okay let's clear this up and let's open the database and the refresh here we are in the user and we have the user now and the isadmin i forget that okay so let's add also the isadmin so is admin and it's going to be one let's save this and run one for the last time Come here and refresh. And now the is admin is one. Okay. Let's open that project in here. Uh, the name is Resto App. Let's go now and log in. We have the admin dash gmail.com. Sorry, admin at gmail.com and paste the password, which is uh, password hit enter i'm not going to save it and we are here now okay that's it for this video friends hope you enjoy in the next one we need to create the admin panel so see you there all the best